what is up guys jake from one half here with a special episode of ninja live i am from the one half patron clan going up against pv punishers we got a live attack going on right now uh you see it's a uh, right now the, the score is way in favor of pv's punishers but they have done a lot more attacks so really way too early in the war to tell anything but it is not too early to catch some unsuspecting victims from the shadows, which is what I'm preparing to do right as we speak. I will be back just in a moment as soon as someone goes in live. All right, here we go. First attack, Big Dog going in on number 30. He's got to go Vaho queued up. Let's see how he does with it. Golem coming in from the left and the right. Going to put Wizards down, obviously, to create that funnel. Make sure everything's going to be heading into the score of the base. Uh, pretty natural funneling base as well, so uh, hopefully this goes this goes well for him. Wallbreakers did work out a little bit of a lag there, sorry. Wallbreakers did work out, got that core opened up, so now he is heading in. Ooh, and they, Wallbreakers went in and got a giant bomb. That is money. Uh, unfortunately, these wizards are skirting around this. Oh, he spent both of them. Uh, the wizards got through the uh, poison spells, and he sort of panicked, dropped both of them. That's not good. These wizards are going to hurt right here. Uh, so we'll see. Maybe you can get through them pretty quickly. Those Valks are raged up. That's going to help, obviously. Yeah, that rage saved him right there. Nicely done. Uh, Dragon coming out. Uh, the, the Valk's going to run in and take this queen out here in just a moment. And we'll see. He's got another giant bomb that he's got triggered there. So he's looking. Actually, is that two more giant bombs? Wow. There was... No, just one. I'm sorry. Just a double giant bomb set there. That's good. So the Hogs only have one set to worry about. The Valks have the core cleared out. They're heading in towards the, that town hall. The King's still up. The Queen's still up. Uh, Golem's doing a little bit of tanking there, so that's good. Uh, he just has that one last giant bomb set to worry about. Oh, he's got one on the right side there, so probably one on the left side as well, and he'll be looking good. He's got a lot of Hogs left. He's got four more to deploy. Here they come on the back side. That was smart because there's likely a giant single giant bomb there, so it'll only affect those four Hogs. He still has that heal spell. Promise to drop it right up top there, exactly where that giant bomb was. This is a three-star big dog bringing it home for the patrons, baby. Yeah, I like to see it. Uh, let's let them know. They're probably getting excited. Uh, let's let them know the ninja is in the house. They'll be they'll be excited about that. Uh, yeah, definitely got plenty of cleanup troops. Got the Valk still up. Got Hogs still up. Uh, King and Queen are up. Look at all them Hogs. He's got a ton of troops. Beautiful attack by the big dog. Still has his Queen's ability. Uh, can just pop that anytime or swag it. Doesn't matter. Uh, last few buildings to go with a minute left. Nicely done, sir. So now they are on alert. They know the deal. They know I'm here. Uh, <laughs> there they are. A little bit of a woo train going. Obviously, it's first, uh, nice one, big dog. Oops, I misspelled that. You got ninja. Man, my typing on this phone is not good. All right. There you go. Uh, I will be back with another one, right? Immediately, right here. We got Chip going in. All right, I love the rapid fire ninja. Here we go. Rapid fire. All right, go T got. He's also got to go Vaho. Coming on the, oh, this is some great uh, low level, uh, you know, Town Hall attack. This is something that you guys don't get to see a lot on the channel, and probably not a lot out there at all, really. Uh, but here you go. Love this stuff. Both of these relatively lower Town Hall nine uh, uh, attacks. So you got the sea troops coming out. You got the poison. That was a nice patient poison right there. Got it on top of that dragon. Got it on top of the wizard. So they're going to be going away pretty quickly. Uh, the golem is out doing tanking in the front. Look at this CC troops here. Got some Valks and a bowler. Interesting combination there. Dra Baby dragons finally down. Uh, golems are moving forward. They're taking the, the giant bombs there. A little bit of damage on uh, to those uh, Valks, but they're getting a heal right there as well. Hopefully they get in here and take out uh, this queen. One more swing should do it. There she goes. She's down. Now it's hogging time. He has a few Valks. I don't know if he missed those. Uh, just meant to drop them, but didn't. Um, I don't know. But he's, he's, he's got a few Valks he can deploy here. His Hogs are the main force, obviously, coming through. Goes ahead and drops that last heal down. Um, it's going to be tough for him to get it. He needs to go ahead and drop them Valks on the back side. Where did he put them down at? Right there. Uh, thinking he should have dropped them right in there where they could possibly have tanked a little bit for these Hogs as they come through. Because it's going to be tough for this small group of Hogs to get through all of that three-point defense right there. Uh, let's see how they do. Take down the first Archer Tower really quickly. The Tesla needs to go just as quick. Those Skeletons are starting to take some of them out as well. That doesn't help. Man, they're doing pretty good here. If there's not a giant bomb, ooh, a spring trap. That's rough. Uh, let's see. King and Queen are up. He's got a definite shot at this. If they can get that wizard tower out of the way, there he goes. Yeah, this is a three-star. He's got it. King and Queen are on the opposite side. Just a few hogs left, but honestly, that's all he needs. He's got wizards on the outside. He's got his uh, Valk on the bottom there. It's perfect. Nicely done. Chip two. 
getting in two three stars in a row. The Ninja's out, and they are bringing their A game. I love it. One more building. There you go. Let's back out uh, to see if we're missing anything. Nope. Uh, nice. Two. Three star ninjas. Oh, man. This typing is, is rough. All right, guys, there you go. I will lurk back into the shadows, try to hang out a little longer, see if I can catch some more attacks for you guys. Don't go anywhere. Okay. All right. Holy crap. Holy crap, holy. It's Mrs. Jake, Ninja Live. Here we go. Zap's coming in on the top air defense. She's got the dragon. She's going for Dragloon round two. Uh, this one's set up pretty nicely, actually, because both of those air defenses are on the same plane there. If she can funnel her dragons in, get those balloons heading that direction with the dragons tanking, uh, she's going to have a shot at this. So nicely done on the funnel so far. Dragons are looking good. Starting to backfill. The loon should be coming in pretty quickly here. Hopefully, these CC troops don't do too much damage. They're, all the dragons are congregating there, so everything should go down fast. It did. Uh, everything is gone right there. I think one more shot. Uh, balloons are going in. They're soaking up a few of the black bombs. She's got to get these air defenses taken care of, and then she is going to be looking good. I am sure she is freaking out right now. This is really looking solid. That sweeper is going to get taken out by the balloons, which is going to be a huge help, and they're going to get onto these Teslas. She's probably got this three-star. Oh, my goodness. She's going to be freaking out if she gets this. Uh, the Tesla, really the only major threat left. That, that Archer Tower cannot do it by itself. This is going to be a three-star. Mrs. Jake, Ninja Live, making history. Uh, her first Dragon three-star attack. So she is going to be pumped. Uh, let everybody know we're ninja on this one. Nicely done, Mrs. Jake. Look at all the dragons left. She absolutely smashed that base. Really good plan of attack there. I have to congratulate her. I did not even assist her with that, so I don't know. If that was all her, then uh, really, really good job, Mrs. Jake. Wow, excellent. We are on a roll. The, the hive is just bringing the pain all of a sudden. We were behind, but just on attacks used, apparently, because the three-star train has left the station. We will see who else goes in now. I'll try to catch at least one more for you guys. Uh, let's see if she's pumped up. Everybody's pumped up for her. Uh, did she even say anything? She's probably shaking. She probably can't even type. She's so pumped up. She gets crazy about this stuff. <laughs> there you go. All right, guys. Hang in there. I will be right back with another attack. Level out. All right. Here we go. Last one, maybe. Uh, Zombie Dalton going in with the Govaho on the... Actually, just... Yeah, the Govaho on the Town Hall 8. I love it. Uh, using the quakes, obviously, to open this thing up. He wants to get in there. He wants to trigger those giant bombs, get them out of the way so his hogs can just get on cleanup duty, basically. A couple of golems going down. They're going to be taking all the damage. Wizards right in behind, uh, creating that foam. Probably a little heavy on the wizards there, but he could use those to also get in, help take out the CC troops as long as they funnel in properly. Here comes the wall breakers, uh, opening it up on the bottom side here. I'm not sure if that was intentional because he's got he's to go through another set of walls now to get into that Core. I'm assuming he wanted to open up the top compartment there. It just didn't go that way. Uh, Dragon and Loon coming in. He drops down a heal spell for his Valks. Uh, hopefully, um, Rage probably been better there for those for those wizards to help take out that dragon. Hopefully, that heal spell keeps him up though. And they keep going. Here's what I was worried about though. With him going through that outside, now he's got the inside opened up. Hopefully, the Valks. Yeah, here they go. The Valks go him. Everything retargeting, going back in there. There's one giant bomb out of the way. If there's another one there, he's in pretty good shape. Oh yeah, 17 hogs. A heal spell for the rest of this base. He should be set. Uh, the golems are going to be doing a, a lot of tanking still. If he can be a little bit patient, he probably should come from the other side. Let those golems tank all those defenses over there. The uh, king and all that. Let them do their job. Uh, that's okay. He's got the hogs coming in here. He's really surgical in this base down. He's taking out a lot of defenses all at once. There's his heal spell for his large group of hogs that he's keeping alive. Uh, if they can get through to this backside, this point of fence, oh, man, that's not good. That giant bomb hurt really, really badly. Again, probably should have came from the other side when he brought his hogs in. Uh, but we'll see. He's got a few Valks up. He's got his king up. His golem is going to do a fair bit of tanking here. As soon as this wizard tower goes down, the golem's pretty much tanking everything at this point. Uh, so this hog gets to kind of sneak through. Unfortunately, they were on the golemites, not the golem. But now they've retargeted the golem, and the Valks are showing up. With the wizards backing them up, he could still get this. A minute, ten seconds. He just needs to get through this compartment. There they go. The Valks are in. Defenses are going down. Uh, golemite is tanking again. The Valks are still up. The Wizard's in there. This is going to be a three-star. Very close to a disaster there with those hogs getting turned into bacon. But he holds on. He keeps a cool head. And Zombie Dalton gets the three-star. Four in a row. Can you believe this? Are one-half patrons, like, amazing or what?
And I love that it was some lower level attacks. I love that stuff. Uh, wow, four, three star train has left the station. I love it. Uh, you guys don't get to see that a lot, so it's pretty cool that you get to see some tonight. Uh, that'll probably do it for this, but I want to remind you guys that we are doing a stream of the, of the end of this war. So tonight, uh, later today, when you're watching this, um, tune in. I, I'll have the link in the description. Obviously, I'll tweet out when I start. Uh, Twitch.tv slash One Hive Rage. Be there. Hang out. Watch the, the end of the war. It's going to be epic. Until then, Jake from One Hive doing my best to help you guys suck less.